Hey guys, it's Lady Pops and today I had a really stressful day. So I went downstairs this morning to make a cup of tea. I'm all dazed and disoriented and I look over at my fish tank and swimming upside down but perfectly alive was one of my female goldfish. Now this really upset me. So I ran straight back upstairs, got on the computer and found out that the reason for this may be that my goldfish has a swim bladder problem. The swim bladder is an organ that fish have that when functioning properly enables them to swim up and down at will. It also enables the fish to maintain its buoyancy. When the swim bladder becomes blocked, infected or too full of air it ceases to do its job, thus the fish's inability to swim or swim properly. Many fish, because of their odd shape, are highly susceptible to swim bladder problems, just like my fish. My fish, it has a round belly and it did not look well. I felt so bad for it. So I did some research and I found this. So step one, get a packet of frozen green peas. Step two, make sure that the peas are nice and defrosted. I just got mine, put them in a bowl, and put them in the microwave for like about 20 seconds and then I rolled them in my hands to get them warmer. Step three is take the skin off of the pea. Now you can do that easily just by giving a little pinch and then pushing it through. Next is to put the pea into the goldfish tank and try and feed the fish. Now that is easier said than done people. Have you ever tried to feed one specific goldfish? I have a lot of goldfish in my tank. I have about six to eight goldfish and they are greedy. I cannot describe to you how hard it is to feed one specific goldfish. Uh, so in the end I had to just uh, drop a load of peas in. A few, I think two other goldfish ended up eating pea, but in the end she did grab two whole uh, halves of a pea, equaling one pea. And then we played the waiting now on the Wikipedia page it does say um, to keep trying if the if the fish doesn't eat the pea immediately remove it and try again uh, the fish will eat the pea eventually and all goldfish are perpetually hungry and require a certain amount of greens in their diet for optimum nutrition and it says until the fish eats the pea withhold all other food I also read somewhere else that you should probably not feed your goldfish for about three days uh, because if it is a blockage, you don't want to keep piling food on. Goldfish are one of the sturdier kinds of fish I've read and I think they'll be fine for three days. If they look a bit weak, obviously I'm going to drop a bit of food in for them, but I think it's okay. Now, uh, the Wikipedia page does also suggest that if you do not want to use pea, you can also use, I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, but alternatively, you can try feeding them live, frozen or free drive Daphnia. So I've just got back upstairs and I am so happy. It has literally been maybe an hour, 40 minutes and the fish already is looking so much better. I, she's swimming um, perfectly fine on her own again and I'm so happy with these results. Now this is a disclaimer, this may not work for all goldfish. The problem might not be swim bladder and they might not react well to the peas, I'm not sure. So. Don't take this as a, this will definitely fix your goldfish. If you suspect something that's seriously wrong with your fish, I recommend taking them to your local fish shop, get the proper medical treatment. I mean, there are a lot of trained professionals out there who deal with aquariums and fish, and they probably know a lot more than I do, but this just happened to work for me. All right then, guys, I am off. Bye.